As you get into your data analysis, you may find the need to pull in data from outside sources. A common place to get data is from the internet. You may have heard people talk about scraping data from a web page and then talking about complicated formulas that pull together that data in Python or R. The good news is Excel will let you scrape data from a website as well. Let's take a look at that in action. Let's say for your data, you need access to the GDP of all the countries in the world and you find that information on Wikipedia, but don't want to manually add the data to your spreadsheet. Excel will scrape that data from Wikipedia for you. And actually, we'll do that from any website where the data is displayed in a table. Here's how you do that. In Excel, go to the Data tab, and in the top left corner, select Get Data from the Web. Copy and paste the URL from the web page that you want to extract the data from. Then hit OK. Then be patient as Excel communicates with the site. Excel will pull a list of possible data tables it found from the site and ask you which one you'd like to pull. You may need to go back to the site to confirm you're pulling from the correct data. In this example, let's say I want the data from the World Bank, so I need to confirm that I'm pulling the correct table. I'll check this by reviewing the total values for each of the tables and then matching that with the data Excel pulls. For the World Bank data, I want the world value GDP to be 85,800,000. I look through the tables to find that value, and when I find it, I select that table and hit transform. Excel will pull that data into my sheet as a query. If it all looks right, you can exit out of the query editor and Excel will add that data to your spreadsheet as a table. Excel will be able to grab data in a table format from most websites. I hope this trick just saved you a bunch of time.